This right here is why the ball keeps popping out of your glove. Now, if you hold up your glove like this and look into the pocket region, you will notice that there is absolutely no possible way that that ball can go through the pocket. So why is the ball popping out of your glove? It's probably your fault, not the gloves. Because believe it or not, if you don't do these two things, it's much harder to catch the ball cleanly. These two things have to do more with our feet than our hands. Okay, rule number one, the one foot rule. One foot should always land as the ball enters the glove. Allow me to demonstrate. An infielder who's fielding a ground ball needs to get their left foot in sync with their glove. The foot goes at the same time as the glove. Same thing when we're playing catch. The foot goes at the same time as the glove. Same thing when a first baseman is stretching to go catch the ball. He waits till the ball's in the air and gets it with one foot. Keeping our foot and glove in rhythm makes it easier for us to catch the ball, just as our rhythm and timing helps us to hit the ball. Second rule that is bare minimum to catching the ball is to position your eyes behind the glove. Whether you're an outfielder and you're catching the ball up here, or you're an infielder and you're fielding the ball down here, either way, the glove should be out in front of the eyes. So we should never try to catch the ball in here close to our body. Why? Because our eyes are now to the side of the ball. There's a lot more room for error. To stop that ball from popping out of our glove, we need to have it out in front of our eyes where we can see it. If you abide by these two rules, not only will the ball stay in our glove more often, it's gonna feel a lot easier and we may just make better throws too. I'm Coach Rack, let's grow.